Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. I hope that you all are having a wonderful day and that you watch this video till the very end. Sir? Sir? Hmm? Your uncle and his partner were already at the living room. You... Got it. You may leave now. Sure. Uh, what time is it? I'm so tired. Hmm? Why are you here? Sir, the young master won't let anyone get close to him. Even the butler can't do anything about it. It's all because he can't even prepare a good bath for the young master. Is he really that cranky? I'll pay him a visit myself. Oh, I remembered. I got up so late because this little boy refused to comply without force yesterday. Go away! He's struggling even harder than yesterday. Don't be fierce, my honey. Little bastard. The kid you saved yesterday is here. I'll get you to him, okay? Wow, this big and luxurious house is Chanmo's uncle's private mansion? He's too bloody loaded, isn't he? This grape doesn't taste bad. Wanna have one? No thanks. I only enjoyed my legs. My hands are just fine. Then why don't you feed me instead? Why should I? If somebody feeds me with their own hand, the grape will test even better. That's enough. Uh, looks like we came at the wrong time. It's that kid. It's wonderful that you're okay. Come to think of it, I haven't learned about your name. His name was given by Ivan, and he seems to hate it a lot. He never even responds to that name. Oh, he might be scrawny and tiny, but he's actually 15. Huh? This height at 15? Ivan must be torturing him. Is Ivan really his guardian? He was, but from now on, they no longer have ties to each other. Uh, you helped him to change guardians? Uncle, you can be thinking about adopting him, right? That's impossible. If those geezers know that I have myself an inheritor, they'll definitely raise rumpus. Inheritor? It sounds that uncle is from an extraordinary background. Well, that can't be wrong. He has a super massive mansion after all. What about Tian Mo? He shouldn't be just a normal royal with family background. Fungi, bring this kid to watch TV for a moment. I'm going out with my uncle. He wants to get a puff. Oh, okay. 
I'll be back soon. Man, you're so clingy. Why do I suddenly feel that he's very distant from me? Say, when do you intend to return to China? In a while, after fungus like heels. You guys are strangely affectionate, I must say. I see that you've developed some feelings towards him. Do you plan on settling down with him? Hmm, I'm quite happy when I'm around him. So you do have feelings for him? Although at this point of time, It'd be rather difficult for you to have freedom in marriage. Uncle, do you mean that my father... Relax, you can still have it easy for a couple of days at my place. Actually, it'll be fine for you to inherit your family business, perhaps. You can discuss about it with Lil Fange. But, you know, that big brother of mine. If you can hold on for another few years, nope, I'm not interested in the chance family business. Don't be so decisive. I still have faith in your abilities. You're much better than that disappointing big brother of yours. Forget it. No matter how useless Chan Bai is, he's still the perfect justifiable eldest son of the Chan family. If it isn't that the perfect inheritor in father's heart had an accident, could such opportunity even come to me? The illegitimate child. Um, Chan Mo, stop. If I had a choice, I wouldn't want Zoli to have me. After so many years, Sean was still offended that he's still being used by Zoli. <sighs> Why would such a good child be born with a mother who only wants benefits for herself? Don't you see it, Vice? Remember to eat the dishes too. But you're already so short, perhaps you won't grow any taller no matter how you're being fed. What's wrong with him? He's been down a little ever since they finished talking. Oh yeah, where do you guys plan to go this afternoon? I'll let Fange decide. Uh, huh? Um, actually, I would really like to visit Tanan lot. I'm not really in their state, too.
To none lord it is then. I can give you a tip to toy service on a wheelchair. Oh, thank you. We'll tag along. This is so magnificent. It's really surrounded by seawater. Wow. This now, it's nothing. Wait until the tide rises. And you'll know why it's called the Temple on the Sea. Let's go have a look inside the temple. Let's go. Hey, wait. Don't run that quickly. This is really a good place. Even kids become hyped. Chianmo, are you feeling unwell? Why do you look so pale? Help! Somebody, help me! Chianmo, I'm sorry. If you want to blame, blame your father. I have no way out of this. Only by sacrificing you, that woman and her child will let go of me. Why? Why do you want to kill me? Chian Mo! What's wrong with you? Why did you... Fange? Why are you crying? It's fine. Some sand got into my eyes just now. Does it hurt? Do you want me to blow it out for you? That won't be needed. But you... Don't your knees hurt you suddenly stood up like that? Hmm? Dumbo is bleeding again. Sit down if you know it's that painful. His hand's cold. And it's shaking. Rest for a while, and I'll bring you to the temple. Chianmo? I suddenly got a little thirsty. Why don't we head to that nearby shop? Sure. Hey. Do you feel better already? Hmm? You look terrified just now. I mean, you look very pale. Are you afraid of water? I'm not. Guessed it. Have you been choked by water when you were young? Well, I did. Then I learned how to swim. And wasn't afraid of the water anymore. You can give it a try too. Hmm. In my case, it's rather complicated. I'll tell you next time.
forget about that. When uncle comes out, I'll let him bring you to the temple. Nah, maybe there's nothing great inside the temple anyways. Although I really wanted to go, but leaving him alone here seems a little painful. So, you want to stay here and keep me company? Of course not. I just don't want to trouble anybody else. Fine then. You can simply order me around. I'm technically yours, you know. Since you are that nice to stay back and keep me company, I'll tell you a story to relieve your boredom, and as a reward for you as well. What good story can be treated as a reward? When I was still in school, the top boy in school was a loner. Later on, he transferred. Guess why? Because his family moved? Or because he was going to study abroad? He encountered emotional abuse. His mother clung onto a married man and had him for the sake of money. But no matter how excellent he is, he'll never be recognized by others. But it isn't him that was at wrong. And why it isn't? Because even his birth was a mistake in the first place. No one deserves to be denied at birth. You know, even if life is in a smooth sail, humans have a very long life. There will always be someone who truly cares for him, stays by his side, and slowly relieve that knot in his heart. I hope that he can find someone like that. Do you truly think of it that way? It might be a little too self-righteous for me to say that. When I fell out with my family and moved out alone, I also got disheartened for quite some time. Although I can't compare to that friend of yours, but I would still like to advise him. There'll always be surprises in life, so don't give up so early. Let me hug you. Uh, what's wrong with you? If I could... I really wish I would have met you some years earlier. Back when you had no home, I would seize the chance to pick you up. In that way, you will be mine. A surprise that belongs to me. Your wound is clotted. Wanna try to take a few steps? Okay. <sighs> Why are you laughing? I already said that I could walk, but you insisted to make me sit on a wheelchair. Alright, alright, it's my fault. Don't trip, Kay. Alright, I have matters to attend to today. I need to go out. Then go. Don't stay here and disturb. You... See you at night. I feel that this guy is getting more and more clingy. But my leg's almost fine now. I guess that we'd be able to leave Bowley Island in a while. 
When we get back to China, everything will be back to normal, right? There shouldn't be anything between two men after all. Uh, so bothersome. Coming. Who are fungi? A big grown ass man trying to play ghosting with me. Do you find it fun? Renji, 